Living the Gospel. Today we are at St. Mestrobe's Heavenly Garden. And um, this is where we grow vegetables. Now, the, the person that takes care of the Heavenly Garden is uh, our parish council member, Russ. And Russ, tell us. Um, first of all, about how many square feet do you work with here? We have approximately 600 square feet, and we grow tomatoes, cucumbers, beans, uh, green peppers, and eggplant. Wow. Today we're doing eggplant. And, and this stuff of, looks good. Yes, this, some this of the looks good. We, on average, we, we send about 250 pounds of produce, fresh produce a year to the Harvest Food Bank, which in turn hmm. distributes it to the different food pantries, and also people can come and get food from the pantry there. This is, this is such a good ministry, because they need fresh food. Yes, they they need decent food. Decent food, yes. And it's do. gardens like this in the city of Racine that produce it. Where else are they going to get it? Exactly. Except from gardens like ours. Um, Ross, tell me the more important question, this is living the gospel, this is about spirituality. Really, why do you do this. I enjoy doing this. First of all, I like working in the garden, but I also enjoy it. It's a way I can give back to the community and to the less to the people who need the fresh produce. It makes me feel good helping to feed them. So by feed, by helping feed them, it feeds me, wow. which I enjoy. Well, which is living the gospel. Yes. People getting fed off of really uh, the, not only the food, but your spirituality and your belief in Jesus Christ and doing what he told us to do. And it's just interesting. I don't know if this fits, but it's today's Bible reading as we film how, how the Word of God is planted in different people in different places. But when it reaches fertile soil, it produces 30, 60, sometimes 100-fold. And Ross, let me tell you, you're not going to want to hear this, right? You're a humble guy, but the Word of God definitely has entered your heart. And look, yeah, it has made you produce so much for the poor so that uh, the words of Jesus Christ can come true that when we feed the least of his, we feed him. Yes. Thanks, Ross. Thank Appreciate you. it.